Hi everyone, uh, good morning. In this video, I'm going to explain about how to use the Udemy business for free if you have a Singapore National Library card. I came to know last week when I met a few members uh, during one of the IT summit. So I was surprised with that last uh, almost two years I uh, have been traveling with Udemy business and we are seeing that success and the benefit out of that. Uh, 13 courses of Ganesh Padala are available on Udemy business now. I know all of these things, but uh, I didn't even know that one. We have a library card uh, for my son. We take some books and also we have a library card, but I didn't ever about this. And there would be uh, many people uh, who don't know this benefit. So I felt like let's make a video so that um, although it is helpful for the people who are staying in Singapore and it's not specific to SAP, and any courses like uh, DevOps or uh, artificial intelligence, machine learning, any IT courses, so even there are few uh, good non-IT courses that are available in uh, Udemy business. I hope uh, many of our friends, uh, many of our um, SAP family or anyone can benefit uh, who are staying in Singapore. If I feel uh, these kind of any useful videos, I will definitely make in the future. So in this video, let me explain uh, how to register uh, for Udemy business and how to access all the courses. Okay, let's get into the video. This is the link I have directly taken from um, National Library website. Uh, this link, I will keep it in the description also so that you can directly access it. Once you click on this link, uh, you will get the user manual, which is well prepared by the respective admin, uh, which can help you to register for Udemy business. Okay, first of all, uh, you should have that uh, library membership. And many of us, uh, we take the membership and take the books, but we may not have the user ID and password. Either you can get from the library uh, in charge or else you can do on your own. This is the first question you can see here. How to access and get started with Udemy business? This is the step-by-step -step user manual. So you click on this, see whether you are using desktop or mobile, whatever. So library username and password you need to be Already if you have, you can directly log in. If you don't have, then you can generate it. So for example, click on this link. Okay. So once you click on this link and uh, let me show you here, the right hand side top, there is a button called login. Click on login. Okay. I already have a user ID and password, so it came directly. Let me log out so that you will get a better idea. So click on the login button. Once you click on the login, you will get in this way. Okay. So if you came for the first time, you can click on the forgot uh, your library username and password. So once you click on that details, uh, then uh, you will get whether you can go with your sync pass or else you can use your um, NRIC pin number. Okay. Then system will guide you how to enroll, how to set your uh, username and password. For example, if I click on this, uh, uh, use NRSR pin number so you can get here you can give your pin number and date of birth and click next button then system will ask you to input your email id user id and password okay so that you can do on your own so let's uh, imagine that you got your user id and password okay once you come to this home screen give your username and password click on continue so as soon as you come to the screen, you can see the multiple options are there. In this video, I'm going to focus on Udemy business. So you can uh, you can see here, there are multiple other things also there you can explore. So click on this Udemy business. Once you click on Udemy business, the courses which are allocated, your system will give you certain kind of options for you. Okay, so if you are going for the first time, you will get certain options. Those options are only for the high priority and the Udemy business can filter for you. But still, for example, I selected some three technologies, but you can see here, I selected cloud computing and the business operations, some two, three things, but you can see uh, personal development, leadership, they're all courses are available, okay? There could be any certain kind of a filtration, but I see that most of the courses are available. So when you come to login for the first time, you can select either you are interested in cloud computing, personal development, those uh, three options you can select it. But uh, once you come inside, even there is a statement also mentioned that uh, although you select that certain courses, still you're able to access other courses also. That's what I can see here now. So all how Udemy Business login is there, it is all available. 
And one thing you can see here, National Library Board, Singapore, you can see in the left hand side, because you are under the Udemy business, you are using uh, with the login of uh, National Library Board, Singapore. So that details are available here. So once you come here and you can uh, enjoy your uh, learning, there are thousands of courses available for free on Udemy business. If you are SAP consultant, you can search for SAP. You want to learn data science or you want to learn uh, uh, artificial intelligence, the latest cloud computing, uh, those any courses, you can click on that and enroll for the courses. For example, if you really wanted to search for our courses also, you can finish uh, Padala. Okay, so if you see here, uh, our uh, whatever the courses are available, right? Those courses also you can see here, MM architecture implementation. So all of my courses are available for free. Okay, do you can uh, check just kind of spadala. Okay. You can see about us and uh, explore. This is normal how, how, how do we search in any places, right? You can search based on the, click on the home screen, okay? So you can uh, check your weekly plan. You can do it, which course you wanted to do it, explore courses, okay? So once you click on explore courses, okay, you can search uh, whether SAP has Fohana or you want to learn uh, Power BI, okay? So anything, if you know the specific trainer, like I mentioned earlier, Ganesh Padala SAP courses, you can find our courses. And if you want to learn uh, Power BI, Power BI best courses. So you will get what are uh, courses available for free on Udemy business, you can find it. And always you can filter based on the ratings or the topics, okay? So the topics, anything you can uh, filter on your own. So with your National Library Board uh, card, whatever you have for the library card, you are going to enjoy the Udemy business courses for free and uh, enjoy learning. And whoever are preparing for the with, uh, dependent pass, anyone, want to learn a certain kind of a new courses, you can utilize this opportunity. I hope um, whoever doesn't know about this uh, feature, I hope they will utilize it. Happy learning and thanks for your time. And I'm keeping the, the, the whatever we have given that user manual prepared by the library board, I'm keeping in description so that you can easily access and you can enjoy the learning. Thanks for your time. If you like our video, uh, you can uh, share with your friends and especially who are staying in um, Singapore, they will get benefit out of this. Thank you. We'll meet with next video.